Hey guys, so yeah, here's Carlos right here. So, yeah, he has charcoal, and I took away bite for fire blast. This will probably be very useful, just because flamethrower isn't gonna be able to KO a lot of things, and bite anyways. Flamethrower, even when resisted, does more than bite. Like, even against a ghost type, Flamethrower would do more. It's just how it would work. Because it's just way more powerful than Bite. Because of Stab and Charcoal. 95 base. So yeah, now we're gonna fight him. So yeah, he leaves with Rhyhorn. And I leave with Blaze. And then he's like, intimidate. And I'm like, fire blast. And he's like, dead. And I'm like, level 61. Yeah. So now he's gonna send in Doug Doug. And I'm gonna go like, flame flame, thrower. And he's gonna die. Exactly. I was gonna send an Eater Queen, and I'm like, Fire Blast! And what? Wow. So, yeah. And, yeah, it should be like a 2 hit KO. I'm guessing. That was like minimum damage. Let's pull. So yeah, and now he's going to be stupid and do that. And I got to burn. So I'm going to stall him out just to get as much HP as possible. So yeah, and that does, and it does half. And I'm just gonna use flamethrower to finish him off. So now all he has left is Needle King. Well, a Needle Queen, which is low at health. So Needle Queen will die, and now it's just me versus Needle King. If I miss, he wins. Or he uses Rash, and he's stupid. So ready? Three, two, one. I win. Sweet. Oh, thank God. So that was Giovanni. Sweet. So yeah. Oh, I thought the emulator just crashed. <laughs> Sweet. So now we got Earthquake, which Growls can't learn, so it's pointless. So yeah, see you guys, and next time we will be preparing for the Elite Four.